Good morning, everybody. Um, or good afternoon, whatever it is, wherever you are. Have a nice day. <laughs> Today, we're going to learn how to uh, build a, um, a fish trap for catching your own bait. Now, what I'm planning on catching are probably small uh, bram or whatever that can come up in there. But uh, let's get started. I'm going to show you the first thing that you're going to need to do this is chicken wire you need some chicken wire with some small mesh okay you gotta be small all right here's some chicken wire and then you're gonna need some snips okay some something that you can cut that stuff with all right and then what I'm gonna use is you can use wire to, to wrap this but I'm gonna use uh, I'm gonna use some of these little ties like that all right, let's get started. Now that we've showed you what you need to, to use, the first thing you'll do is get you a piece of your wire and go ahead and just make a cylinder out of it, okay? I'll show you that here in just a second. All right, everybody, now I've got my cone in there, okay? And I uh, attached it all around the edge of the cylinder real good before I trimmed the rest of it off. Now you see we've got quite a bit left of the uh, the cone. Alright. We're not going to be needing it. But as you can see um, there's the cone. Got me a cone that goes down through there. Alright. Now this is where the fish are going to go in at. They're going to swim in through there and they're going to go through the little hole in that cone in here to try to get at the bait that I'm going to put bread or something in here and uh, the last step of this is to cap this end of the net I mean the, the trap we got to put a piece of screen over the end of this or some kind of a plug we got to plug that hole with something that we can get in and out of it easily because this is how we're going to get our bait out through this end whenever we uh, get some bait in there. Alright, we'll be back with that step in a little bit. Alright folks, the final step I went through was uh, made, made, made me a cap for the other end. What I do is I took some of that wire right there and folded it over kind of so it makes a little hinge, okay? Now what I can do, put my, put my bait in here, my hot dogs or bread or whatever I'm going to use to attract my, my bait. And then I can just push that closed, and I've left these little tabs sticking out to where I just push it in there like that, and it'll catch. And that will hold shut. So that's sealed on that end. They can't get out. And when I get ready to uh, get them out, all I got to do is come over and just give it a little pull. Like so. And it'll open right back up. See there? That's my... Homemade uh, bait trap. Now, I'm going to put something, some bait in it. Now I'm going to go set it out there in the lake. And here, on the next little clip, you will see what happens. Bye-bye. All right, the next thing I've done is I've taken a bunch of cat food and put it inside some pantyhose. And uh, I hung that in there. Like that. Right in front of that little cone and uh thrown some old lunch meat in there too you can probably put anything in there i don't care it don't matter i'm gonna go drop it in the water be back in a minute all right there it is y'all just just throw it out there in the water <laughs> sink it down in underneath the water and uh wait for your fish to come around and get in it now i'm gonna help them out a little bit by coming around by scattering a little bit of dry cat food around here just to attract some all right man thanks for watching this uh, ain't no reason to continue this video and show you how I catch, how many I catch, because it's going to catch them. You can guarantee that. Bye bye. Thanks for watching. Hey, uh, let me um, stress to you about when you make your trap, if you're going to make one like this, the center of your cone, which what I'm talking about is the small end of the cone put it directly in the center 
of your cylinder okay keep it away from the edges of that cage because those little fish are running around the edges trying to find a way out so keep it directly in the center as much as you can okay yeah and it seems to be working because down here I got a bucket I got about seven or eight of them in there already that I've put in this bucket and uh, they're still they're still getting up they're still gathering themselves up in there and there's plenty more all along through here there I mean they're everywhere they're everywhere there's tons of them yeah <laughs> y'all know what's up with this y'all y'all know what's up it's me crazy man with a blue cup that's what's up oh I think I see a new song coming I may have to make a new song but anyway uh, y'all know what's up as soon as I'm going to make me another one, I'm going to go make me a nice fresh one. When I get done with this here in about five, ten minutes. And uh, then I'm getting in the doggone canoe with my bait. And I'm going out here to do some fishing. And I'm bringing you with me. <laughs> that's right. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> that's right. Here on Lunatic's Channel.